Hello, and welcome to a day in the life of Vel. I hope you enjoy the effort that went into making this video, and please don't mind the mess. Thank you so much for watching. Okay. The lighting in here sucks, but I'm about to get ready. So here is what I get ready with. Ta-da, all my, all my shit. So let's do that. I have already done the majority of what I need for today, but I still need to put some stuff on. So here we go. Now, obviously, I already fed the cats. Whew, turn on some light. I generally would, but right now I'm not going to turn on any light. Woo! But here's my outside view, my only light source. All my junk, my kitchen table. We came from the back, but the fun part is that today I have to actually, woo! Start getting my stuff done. It's a lot cleaner. I can walk through here, but let's pull this light here. Woo, bright light, thank you. We have to get more firewood. So essentially what happens is everything must be burned at some point or another. This bag is for the burn barrel outside. And then usually we have cans or other assortments, um, which I have to dump out the can thing right now. So yay, you guys get to come with me to do all that. This will be fun. Let's hope my battery doesn't run out. Whew. Here we go. Through the net. Oh, set that down. Unlock the door. Maybe this is a two-handed thing. Hold up. Why are you being weird? There we go. There we go. Okay. Opening the door. Thank you. Oh, bright fucking light. Oh. Ay, yeah, yeah. And the cans. Oh. Yeah. Here's what I'm looking at. It's fucking bright as hell outside. But it's good. We're going over here inside this dusty, dank area with all kinds of stuff. We leave our cans here. Obviously, we only drink one thing or two things. There we are. That's fun. We need more firewood, obviously. And we're gonna really need to chop more, too. This is the fun, outdoorsy life that I now live. Here we go. So let's just... Set this sucker back in here. This is actually for cleaning out the ash in the fireplace, but that's also what we use that for. So let's see. I'm gonna leave that slightly open because we're gonna come this way and do a fill up. Oh crap. It's like itty bitty little sled thing. Should have brought my gloves, totally didn't. isn't necessarily that important right now. We will have to cut more firewood later, yes. But with it turning summer and it's already spring and hot. Oh, hello little bug. Hey Roo. Excuse me. You're not gonna let go of that, are you? Nope. Okay. Well, I'm gonna take this wood then. It's the only other unfortunate thing about everything being outside. Oh, I think that's enough. Everything else looks dead bug to me. All right, and I need two hands for this, so forgive me. I get right alongside the wood. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. uh, there we go. Uh. Wood. Oh. Sorry for the swinging. Uh. That's literally what that's for. So, come in. Put the wood over here, clearly. Uh, we don't exactly need it, but it is very good for, like I said, burning things. And actually, it's a good starter. I'm gonna keep you out here. Woo. Uh, and for not breaking your fingers on it, that's a fun part, as I'm not throwing things. Forgive me. Woo. I take the box back outside. <sighs> Hold that. And we don't ever leave the door open because of the cats, obviously. <sighs> wow. Well, I put this back. So now, if we have to burn something, that's what I've got left on my firewood pile. Otherwise, I'll have to go up to my grandfather's. There are some of my boxes from moving. Those are the good size boxes that I don't want to get rid of. So that's what that's doing in here. We have lots of wood, okay? We can build shit, it's great. <laughs> it's actually super duper nice right now. I think it's maybe about, I don't know, it's about 50. It feels about maybe 50, 55, but anyway. It's just so bright, and it's so not inside. Generally, we come in here to see where that's at. If it's good, then we know we can make stuff. Magic. So essentially, come in here, get some lights turned on. Yep, this is our little stove and whatnot, and I did dishes last night, so essentially I'm just going to clean up what I already did. doing? Are you being a cutie cutie cutie? Are you being a cutie cutie? This is what I'm putting up with right now. Hi. What you doing? You don't even want your ball or your mousy? Don't even want your sketchy post? What you doing? 
What you doing? I know, Mommy just cooked. I made it stink in here. <laughs> yeah, you can get in the window. Finally, finally, you're gonna be the cutest little chin in the whole world. Oh. oh, it's so interesting, but I want to just not. Yeah, you just want to rub against me? It's all you want to do? So, usually, Ahsoka and I like to watch movies together. But since I'm kind of busy over here doing my thing, watching videos, she decided that it wasn't good enough. So she came to sit on my lap. <laughs> You're so pathetic and cute. Yeah. Did you need mommy love? Was it that bad? We weren't cuddling. I know it's not movie time yet. You have like a whole hour. She's like watching Yui who is in the window. Oop. I can't focus either. There we go. Yui's literally sitting there just <laughs> doing her thing. Hello, Soka baby. You are such a good girl. Yeah. So she's quite comfortable. I have literally been sitting here doing this for hours. But she just now decided that it was just absolutely high time that she come over here for some attention. <laughs> so here we are. And uh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, yeah, this is a third of my day right here. Just watching the Yui. Oop, there we go. Hi, baby. Are you just getting some sun? Yeah, you just getting some sun? You know, you have to sniff every time. Does that make you feel better? You're such a weirdo. And you, you're not helping. Yeah. Yeah, are you going to look cute? Show everybody how cute you are. Oh, there's the Yui. Oh, whoa, jealous. Hi, jealous. <laughs> what is it? What are you guys looking at? Oh, my camera is reflecting and, like, light is on the ceiling. And it was fluttering about. Dear God. That is just something to chase, huh? Hi, baby. Right here. Yep, the third of my day. Just loving kitties and watching how cute they are. Yes, it's reflecting off the fucking ceiling. Oh my god, you're so weird. So, it's just about that time. Um, I might need to go out. Woo! And check the generator. Let's see if I need to turn it on. Let me see where are we at. 13.7. It's slowly going down. I wouldn't necessarily go out unless it's about 12.8-ish. Uh, but, you know, yeah, here's me watching videos and not doing, you know, what people would think that I'd be doing, but not really. There's one computer. Here's an entirely different computer with the monitor. It's literally just sitting here. My Cintiq will be here at some point. Right now it is currently in a box and I'm struggling, but I mean, to be fair, look at all the organizing I've done. So it's, it's been, it's been busy for anyone who needs to know. So guys, see you. She's so not even paying attention. But yeah, I will grab you guys uh, when it's time to go outside. So see you then. Look at all the ash on here. Literally. From the fireplace. That's how dirty this motherfucker is. <laughs> but you know, it just depends. Ugh. Anyway, we need to go outside. It's just getting to the point where the sun is going down and we're at 2.8, which is about where I need to be doing that. Do I have my keys? Do I have the things? Yes, gloves. Oh, I have to fill the damn thing with gasoline too, so this is really going to be fun. Okay. Usually I would take this light that is bright as fuck, but we're going to do that when we go turn the generator off. But we need to go turn it on, so am I missing anything? Let me think about it. Hmm. I think I got everything I need, so Q 
keys things because I think Papa might have locked the door. Whew. Oh, windy and beautiful. I don't know if you could hear the rushing, but whew, that's the wind. Yikes. Woo, windy, windy. It's pretty though. It's super pretty. Oh, this is probably going to be blinding light, at least when you walk this way, so yeah, it's how you know it's time. Solar panels are up there on that building, so oh, that's kind of where we're going. There's a lamp post for when we're doing this at night. Oh, see this truck, you guys? This is the truck I learned to drive in on this mountain, which is very, very dangerous, but yeah. Wind turbines, lots of solar panels, it's a thing. Actually, I think he might have left everything just sitting, everything's just fine, look at that. Oh, light, which I don't think I really need at this point, but oh, just so you guys can get an idea of what the hell all I've gotta do, I'm gonna set my camera down here and let's have some oodles of fun. This is gonna be great. Oy. Checking the generator for how much I've got to fill it up. This is going to make a mess. So i got to watch it and be real careful. Hear the gurgling? It's so ridiculous. Alright, now that's pretty much full. This will run about six hours, as is. Alrighty, come here, you. Actually, let's flip that back around. Sorry, camera movement, blah, 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 things. Anyway, so I come back here, make sure everything's good. Gonna turn this. Oh, and my battery's dying, go figure. I'm gonna pull this rod, and I'm gonna pretty much just start it. That's it. Maybe I'll get to show you guys another time. But uh, yeah, gotta switch that battery out.
So for anyone who's following me for my book, I've got 30 pages right here. <laughs> I know you guys have not seen or heard anything about it in a while, but we've been busy. Ugh. You ready for dinner? Are you hungry? No? You want num nums? Yeah, you do? Okay. It is officially num num time. Soka is good. Oh, why? Oh, it's in my pocket, that's why. <laughs> Hold on. Ah, okay. Grab, grab. They have their stuff underneath the bed so that I don't trip on them. Because that is the last thing I bloody want to do is, you know, trip and fall on my cats. So let me set this up because this is not a one-handed job, okay? Feeding these very violent children who get mad when you don't have their food ready. I got it! Okay, we are officially eating turkey, so I hope you guys are ready for turkey. Yeah? Are you, are you a turkey fan? Okay. You sound like a turkey fan. You're really excited. Whoa. I'll spare you guys the details of cleaning that up. And we just grab both bits. All right, baby girls, come on. Get your spots, come here. So Ahsoka's over here. Oh, this is so dark. Yui's right there. Cause I don't want her butt in the flame, which she tends to do a lot. So when I smell nice burning hair, I know what it is. Hello. <laughs> uh, God, there's literally no space in here whatsoever. Just so you guys know. Anyway, ah, there we go. For anyone who ever thought that this life was glamorous, I hate to break it to you guys. Ugh. Everyone has romanticized how this li life living is. And let me tell you, it's, it's not the greatest. Um, I could find some better lights, man. This is a 1950s trailer that was converted and added on top of as you guys can tell from the back here, and the beautiful job my dad did building everything. Um, so yeah, it's kind of, he's even got his pants hanging here. This is how like post-apocalyptic I always say to BJ and everyone who asks, you know, like this, this, is, this is what you're looking at guys. This is it. It's not the greatest. It's no cabin in the woods romantic kind of idealism that most people have. So, oh, camera, you kill me. Oh, there we go. So, as you guys can obviously see by my exasperatedness, I just went outside to uh, do the whole turn on the generator bit. Don't worry, I have not only my knife, but I keep a uh, sharpener with me that has a whistle, like a loud as fuck whistle. Trust me, it nearly made me deaf. So, believe me when I say it's safe, it's really not that big of a deal. Oh, camera, I hate you so much right now. Okay. So it's just one of those things where, you know, everyone might want to be like, oh, this is such a great and fantastic idea. And wow, out in the woods, it's so beautiful. I mean, like, yeah, it is beautiful depending on where you're looking at. You guys have seen the pictures. I mostly take pictures out that window or out that window. Uh, sometimes if I'm walking around or if I need to go to the end, which I get in my Jeep, by the way, <laughs> and I drive all the way to the edge of the property and I try to make a phone call if I can because Verizon sucks up here. Um, no offense, Verizon, but you just, you do. Um, <laughs> so a lot of these pictures is me like out and about the whole area is pretty but like the actual trailer living and the garage as i've shown pictures in my blog it's very scavenger post-apocalyptic like this is the best shit for uh you know thinking of how people scavenge and put things together but because my dad is a general contractor We've got wood, <laughs> we've got tile stuff, we've got all kinds of stuff. We just did some staining on the stand that he built for me for my TV. I'll show you guys later if I get some video clips of that, I'm sure I will. But ideally, it's just a whole bunch of things thrown together and like some of it looks great, some of it doesn't. So 
eventually when I get to build my own place up here, it may look better because I'll have it planned out from the beginning. It won't be converting an old trailer. Okay, we are sitting here getting ready for our movie. Dun, dun, dun. We're actually watching Dracula Untold for anyone who's like, what the hell is this? But yeah, this is the uh, thing my dad built. Oh, let's pause the movie. Pause the movie. Ah, oh, there's not much light in here, so let me change this real quick. Dun, dun, dun. So we have a fully built in, all the way up to the ceiling, uh, stand for my PS4 and my TV. It was sized specifically to this TV, so it just sits here, but there's, there's a lip to make sure that it doesn't fall. Same with the PS4. So, yeah. There's my power strip. I just turn it off whenever I want. And it's all... cords are in there, and awkwardly the plug-in is up there. My dad was kind enough, because again, he's a general contractor. He can do all those electrical things for me. Soka baby! Ah, uh, Soka! She's mad that I'm not actually sitting here watching a movie and I'm doing this with you guys, but <laughs> she could suck it for a minute. <laughs> What's the matter, baby? She's so mad. Um, but yeah, I have this cute little lighting system up here. Easy peasy. That's usually the kind of thing that I deal with. There's my other shelves that he built me. Yeah, don't you love those wires? Oh, it's great. But <laughs> it's because I usually have my iPad over here. You know, I actually work, guys. You know, anything to help me out. You know, ibuprofen, you know, drinks, etc. Um, because we are at such a high altitude, I have this mini humidifier because it literally saves my life at night. And then I have one other shelf over here. Ta-da! My sticker! It's so pee. And my water because I will wake up in the middle of the night and I will need water. So this is kind of it. This is what we're looking at. And uh, yeah, this is over here because this wall is not insulated and there used to be a window right here, which I unfortunately am mad at dad about, but it's okay. So he just kind of left that there and at least I've got a ceiling fan, guys. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Let's see, there's another window over there. It's kind of covered up now with all my junk, but I usually watch Yui. For the most part, I watch her through the mirror over here. She has realized to look in the mirror and she can see me. But right now I've got a curtain hanging here. I've got a curtain that goes there if I need it. But yeah, we try not to hang the curtains onto the floor because that's a heater and it gets really fucking hot. So yeah, this is the bedroom. This is literally what we do. Boink! Oh, so this is movie night. Well, most nights are movie night, but... Mostly because, as you guys must have seen earlier in the clips, Ahsoka was really fucking pissed off that I did not spend time with her today. So, this is movie time! Boop! I have a Yui. She's snuggling. Yeah. Unfortunately, though, she's going to get up as soon as I move. But we're done with our movie. That's it for tonight. It's bedtime. She's purring so loud. <laughs> but yep, movie over. Gotta go turn off the generator, baby. Mommy's gotta get up, honey bunny. Yeah. She's just so stinking cute. Alrighty. Outside then. Ready for the outside? I got my bright ass light. Here we go. Oh. Gotta go turn off the damn generator. <sighs> so it's. We've got some lights outside and everything. It's not terrible. Oof. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, 
it's gonna get louder as I get towards the generator, so I'm probably going to silence it. Oh my god, can you see the moon? You can see the moon! Holy shit, look at that, you guys! Oh, barely through the trees, but yeah. So there's the lamppost, and the generator's in there. So for the most part, this light is <laughs> bright as fuck and meant to blind. Uh, well, cougars, mountain lions, for God's sakes, a bear if anything, but typically there aren't any of that around here while the generator is running. So there's also a loud as fuck whistle in my pocket, so if I need to use it, I will. Oh my God, the coolest part is you can see the fucking night nice sky. Barely, but, and my froggies that like to stay over there. Haha, -ha. so what I couldn't show you earlier because my battery ran out, that's the generator. You have to turn on the generator, turn on the battery charger. Here are all the batteries. Here's all the electrical nonsense, blur diddy blur blur. It's just a bit too much for me. Inverters, all that shit. Whew. Those are questions for dad. But anyway, now it's quiet. That's what the light's for. And there's keys in my pocket that jingle. But my froggies. When I'm in bed, I can hear froggies. They're right over there because there's a tiny little pond. They're itty bitty, but they're loud as fuck. So it's kind of nice. It's dead silent up here except for little froggies at night. So I know, shining my light on my left. Pretty much have my keys jingling in my pocket. And since I'm talking to you guys, I'm pretty fucking loud anyway. But most of the time, nobody comes around with a generator. Not unless it's a desperate animal that's hungry, but either way, it should still be fine. Ha-cha-cha. And that is literally it. Whew. Come inside. Turn off the light. Hi, babies. What you doing? Hello, baby. <laughs> oh, double click. Hang that up. I know you guys can't see anything. Hold on. I swear. Hold that, Yui. <sighs> there we go. <laughs> Mommy's coming. So yeah, that is literally my whole night. Whew. Let me flip this around. <sighs> so essentially, here, let me fix that. Ooh. Oh, so essentially, um, I'm in a big jacket. You know, I've got... My loudest fuck whistle in my pocket, those kinds of things. Got my keys that jingle. Ah, and my phone. So it makes all the noise I need. But uh, yeah. Woo. Uh, sitting down now. But yeah, my dad's jacket, uh, keeping warm and comfortable. But this, this is it. This is the night. Hi. Yeah, I know Yui. <laughs> so turn off the movie. Turn off. Anything that needs to turn off. Um, and that's literally it. So, I'm going to bed because the generator has charged up the batteries for the night. So, boop. That is not where that goes, but I'll fix it later. So, that's kind of it. Just turn off lights, literally go to bed, hang out, and fall asleep till the next day, till the sun rises at least. And then I don't have to worry about turning anything on. So, that is a day in the life of. Vel for right now. I know it's so great. You can see Yui is entirely ready for bed. I see. I see you. Yeah. Everybody else is gonna see you too, right there. Yep. Yep. There's both of them. Yeah. We see you. It's okay. We're totally ready for bed. Anyways, that is it for now. Whew, I can't really hold on to anything. Have a good night. <laughs> Day in the life of Vel. And uh, I'll see you guys another time. Bye-bye.